Hi, I'm Kevin, and welcome to your New Year's meditation. If you've never done meditation before, it's totally fine. I'll walk you through it every single step of the way. Um, how I've kind of developed these uh, meditations is based off of um, a little bit of praying and asking God, like, what what do people need to hear? What do I need to hear right now? So mostly, as I'm doing this, I am doing meditations that I would want someone to speak over me, and I hope that they're life-giving for you as well. Like in all spiritual practices, remember, take what serves you, and then if it doesn't serve you, no big deal. Leave it and continue on with what works for you. So for this meditation, um, we're going to be focusing on a couple of different ideas, but first let's introduce the basics of meditation, and then we'll get into kind of the, uh, the guided part of the meditation. So wherever you are, make sure you're seated comfortably, whether it's on the floor, in a chair, on the couch, maybe you're sitting on your bed. I wouldn't recommend lying down completely because sometimes meditation can relax us to the point of sleeping. So um, if that's your intention, absolutely go for it. But if more mindfulness meditation is your aim, make sure you're sitting up. Okay. Just breathe it out real quick. Now I want you to start by deepening your breath in through the nose and out through the mouth. You can keep your eyes open right now, just continuing to breathe in and out. In through the nose and out through the mouth. See if you can lengthen your inhale and now lengthen that exhale. One more breath, just like that. Now you can let your breath return to normal, letting your mouth close if that's where it is, and just breathing in through your nose, letting your body return to normal, and just note your breath. Is it shallow? Is it deep? Does it feel tense? Does it feel relaxed? Not looking to change it, just noting how your breath is today. And on your next inhale, go ahead and close your eyes. Allow yourself to just start the relaxation process. Start noticing any sounds that might be around you in the room. Maybe there's a car outside, or it's the hum of your air conditioner or heating unit, or maybe it's your kid in the next room. Whatever that is, just note it. Don't let it become a distraction. And if it does, if it becomes a distraction, if it gets you off track later, all you have to do is just note that it happened and return to your breath. The in and the out. Now starting at the top of your head, begin working your way, just checking in. In your head, in your brows, are they relaxed or are they furrowed? See if you can relax those muscles in your face, in your cheeks, in your jaw. Maybe your jaw falls open a little bit. And then check on the back of your neck, starting from the base of your skull all the way through the backside. Remembering to breathe. And as you breathe in, breathe in the relaxation, the light. And then breathe out the tension from your shoulders and your arms and your hands. Breathe in that relaxation and peace into your chest and your stomach and torso. And breathe out all the heaviness that you've been carrying today. And breathe in, rest into your legs and your knees, your calves. And breathe out the weight of the journey that you've been carrying with you. And breathe in restoration and light and love into your feet that have carried you this far. And breathe out the need to, to know exactly where you're going. Continuing to breathe in the presence 
and breathe out the lack that you feel, knowing that you live in an abundance of God's love, knowing that you, no matter what, cannot get away from the love of God. And I want to really focus in on that feeling of love right now, that abundance of love, almost as if we're standing in a lake waist deep. I wonder if you could picture that with me as you're just continuing to breathe. Picture yourself somewhere beautiful, somewhere, whether it's a lakeside or it's tropical, or maybe you're in a jungle. Just picture yourself in a space next to some calming waters. And there's flowers and there's fragrance. And you can just breathe in that peace that is abounding in creation when we look for it. And I want you to feel this water around you that you're sitting in, or standing in maybe. And just feel the way it moves around you and surrounds you. The way it makes your body feel light. And yet you can feel it holding you at the same time, giving that gentle resistance as you just swim your way through it out into deeper waters, surrounded by just the utmost affectionate feeling from a lover, from a friend, from someone you've known a long time. Maybe you're looking for a parent's love, a mother's love, a father's love. Maybe you're looking for uh, an affectionate kind of love, someone who just feels uh, closer than your own skin. I want you to breathe in that kind of love into yourself, knowing that you have access to it at all times. Breathe in that deep love that's surrounding us in this water, in this body of water that we're sitting in right now. Allow yourself to just float there. Releasing the tension from your, your brows and your shoulders. Feeling the waves push you up. With every breath, the tide moving with you. There is nowhere to be but here. No place to be but right now. Now, I want you to take a moment as you're here to just allow yourself to imagine this coming year. Imagine the things that you want to accomplish, not just the challenging things, but the things you know will bring you joy. Maybe it is a project that you've been working on, some art that you want to bring into existence. Maybe it's a partnership, whether romantic or business or, or interpersonal. Just picture those things, those connections you want to bring forth, those loves you want to foster. I want you to picture those things and hold them almost as if they were like uh, beautiful stones in your hand that you gathered from this river. And as you're holding them, like look at them, pick them up and examine them. And ask yourself, am I worth it? And I want you to hear your own self speaking to you saying, yes, I am worth it. I am not only worth it, I am worthy to receive good things. I am worthy of loving family. I am worthy of loyal friendships. I am worthy of respect and dignity. And because I know that I am worthy, I know that everyone in creation is also worthy. And now what I want you to do is like with all these dreams, like these uh, stones that you have in your hand, I want you to just kind of hold them out in front of you and then release them. 
Just let them fall to the ocean floor, thinking about how you can just release expectation of accomplishment, how your worth is not found in what you will do or what you will make or who you will be with, but it's found in who you are, who you have always been. Just, I want you to just hold on to that for a moment. I want you to focus on this, this mantra with me. The mantra of, I am beloved. So with every breath, I want you to breathe in, I am, and exhale, beloved. I am beloved. Remember to keep breathing. You can start bringing yourself back into the room now, feeling the floor under your your, your, uh, your backside, feeling the back of your chair against your lower back and shoulders, maybe wiggling your toes and fingers. And as you're able, just gently blinking your eyes open. Take another deep breath with me real quick. Exhale. And just give yourself a moment to have gratitude for this time you took for yourself today. Recognizing that the peace that you feel is open to you at any time. Anytime you need a moment to recenter, a moment to feel loved, a moment to find your grounding. You can always just close your eyes, take some breaths, and hold on to that mantra of I am loved. And how you can just release expectations of things that you think you have to do or the person you have to be. So, carry love with you today, my friend. I hope you have a fantastic day. Hey friends, thank you so much for joining me for this meditation. I hope that it was life-giving for you and I hope that it served you well. If you want more meditations like this, I actually give away five downloadable meditations every single month to my supporters on Patreon. What Patreon is is a great way for folks like you to support the content creators in your life that are making the stuff that matters. So if you want access to five monthly meditations per month, not to mention a bonus podcast, um, community, free shirts, so many other things, you can go over to patreon.com slash the Kevin Garcia and learn more about what being a sustaining partner with me and my work is. So thanks so much for listening, and I hope to see you over on Patreon. Uh, link is in the description box below. And all right, we'll talk soon. Bye.